Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Take two. And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some Jarvan Shen to start the day off today. On this stream today, we are going to take three of the decks that did the best this week. While we're doing some uh, random rank up decks, we we're trying out a bunch of new things, seeing what I liked. Um, I really liked the feel of all three of these decks, so that's what we're going to do today. And we're going to play seven games with each one of the three decks instead of the normal five, so we can get some more practice with them and hopefully do a little bit more ranking up. So, you know, we'll have, um, you know, instead of having like three two records or four one, you know, we'll have like four three five two, that kind of stuff. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully positive records. So we'll have Jarvan Chen. Uh, Gangplank's Fate and Vladimir Braum. With Gangplank's Fate and Vladimir Braum being two decks we played yesterday, they both felt quite impressive. Um, this one was from a few days ago, like four days ago, the Jarvan Shen. Um, but I, I liked it a lot. The, the thing that I'm worried about with this Jarvan Shen deck is Sejuani, that card, um, and just Frostbite in general. But in particular, a leveled up Sejuani is going to be... A, a huge problem and gangplank and the fact that gangplank sejuani is pretty popular right now that's kind of bad that's kind of bad so that's the one thing i'm worried about with this deck besides that i really liked how it felt um one option to try to fight sejuani could be concerted strike um and so maybe concerted strikes better than single combat in this deck because a lot of our things have pretty low health anyway we're not like a great single combat deck to be honest and so i could see doing concerted strike where you can concerted strike like you know like a let a river shaper strike plus then have like a screeching dragon kill something and get the get the fury you know that kind of stuff so while we're playing these games when we draw single combat um and we have single combat in hand let's think about would single combat be better as concerted strike i have a pretty low curve anyway just just in general right like especially for this style of deck um i have a pretty low curve like i'm playing prismatic barriers um you know five one drops uh, you know, so I don't have a whole lot of like super expensive spells in here, you know, like just the one deny, one repost, two spirits refuge as the top end for the spell. So I, I really, so I do think that we could play concerted strike instead of single combat. The thing is, there's a lot of like these Zed aggro decks where concerted strike is just pretty expensive against all those kind of things. So may, yeah, so I'm, I'm not, I haven't decided yet, but for single combat or concerted strike, but that's, that's something that I'm going to be paying attention to in these games. Besides that, I like the rest of the list. Um, yeah, like the rest of the list. So let's go ahead and get to it. I could see playing four one drops, but right now, again, with all those aggro decks running around, I think the one drops are pretty good. So I'm happy with having five instead of four. All right, let's play some games with Jarvan Shen. We'll go play th uh, seven games in ranked once I find it. Jarvan Shen, J, ranked. All right, here we go. Correct. Concerted Strike would not help against leveled up Sejuani that had frost. They can frostbite everything. It's really like before before Sejuani levels up is where it could help. Or um, if you get lucky, like after. Yes, yeah, so it'd be it'd be before Sejuani levels up. Or once Sejuani's leveled up, it's really difficult. You know, there's not really anything like. Well, you can bounce it with Will of Ionia or detain it. It's just not cards that you want to play. Vladimir Brom. I could see keeping a sharp sight. All right, but we got twin disciplines, which is basically sharp sight. Same thing; they're both broken. Um, yeah, there's just not good answers to Sejuani once it's leveled up. You know, you can maybe have, yeah, you know, maybe after it frostbites everything, then play large unit and then concert strike or play two units. Like you then play two mana, three two bright steel protector plus. We swim within the um, magic. Plus, like a Shen, and use both of those with Concerted Strike. I don't know. There's not great options. Them away. What form will the waters take? All right. So the cards that we have in our hand are not doing very much damage. Destruction feeds my fire. Hmm. Interesting. Um I 
Hmm. Who does not know the name Laurent? Yeah, it's a pretty nice Ember Main right here. I don't. Let us get going. Didn't really love any option against it. option against it. Hey, Srammy. A gift from the river folk. <sighs> my shield is my sword. Really hope this works. They were pretty hesitant with the attack. Gives me confidence. Wow, another full chance. I'm pretty, I'm pretty willing to concede right about now. I don't think that we have much of a chance. Yeah, yeah that one's over. And pray for the fallen. Ember Maiden dominated that game, but then you know the double, the the two troll chance to back up Ember Maiden. So even if I would have tried to fight earlier, I had no chance. Ember Maiden plus Double Troll Chan. GG's. Obviously with the Scar Grounds, right? So Scar Grounds, Ember Maiden, Double Troll Chan. Dominate that game. And then the, the Braum. Um. I don't know. It's been, Yeah, it's been a while. I, I, well, I don't know. We face Vladimir Braum every once in a while. Maybe every one out of 100 games. Maybe a little less than that. Okay, Viego. Viego Ionia. Eh. I mean, these cards are okay. Yeah, like, this is an okay hand. It's just our deck is so much better if we have Shen. And so I kind of want to mulligan stuff and just try to find Shen. Our deck's so much better with it. We'll keep the Protege. Okay, our first hand was a lot better than this hand. That's, that's the thing about mulliganing, is sometimes you get a worse hand. Oh, I like the... Take the high ground. Who does not know the name Laurent? River shape the land and give it life. Harry, so there's there's not really any downside of playing that River Shaper before combat, because even if they would have played like a good blocker, I still just only challenge and nothing else. 
Oh man, I could sharp sight in single combat, but then how, how do they save it? Then they I guess they can't really save Viego, can they? A sharp sight single combat. Obviously there's like Nopify and like cards like that that I don't think they're playing. Well, they could be playing Twin Disciplines. That could be a card they could play. But I guess if they have Twin Disciplines, I can't stop it anyway, so Let's keep River Shaper alive. And they're only playing one champion, and they got their champion, and I'm playing two, and I have zero. They are playing Twin Disciplines. Yeah, GG's. Alright, so this is the time where Concerted Strike would have been better, right? Like, we would have we would have passed, kept our three mana available, we wouldn't have had to waste that Sharp Sight. Yeah, Concerted Strike would have definitely been better. Because then this round I would have been on Concerted Strike plus Sharp Side, but they would have had double Twin Discipline, so maybe it wouldn't have worked as well. Yeah, what a hand. What form will the waters take? A gift from the river folk. That's just a perfect hand. Just have a Viego and all sorts of great spells. Yeah, what a hand. I command you. I guess you do. So Twin Disciplines beats Sharp Sight. So we saw with this uh, this game. We had two Sharp Sights, they had two Twin Disciplines. Hey, Gavin. Yeah, Rune Terror is pretty easy to get to. Pretty pretty easy to get into. Sorry. Absolutely. Just just download it for the first time. Enjoy. Um, there's a link here for new players from like a Reddit post from a while ago that could also help out. Protect their own. Keeper, our lands need us. Man, our opponents are really running hot so far. Two perfect hands. Did all I could. Two perfect hands. Playing against Go Hard now. Send it all back. See if we find Shen. Hmm. Not our day. Flea Feather Tracker, not so good against a Go Hard deck. One health. So they're just chilling over there with all removal, it looks like. River shape the land and give it life. Success. 
Success. Get you noticed around here. If I kill you, I don't fuck you, stupid. Huh. Huh. So they have Pesky Spectre in their deck. What form do the waters take? So they have Pesky Spectre. You're in over your head. I only have one deny. Never lost a fair game or played one. Something for all. No quarter. A game. Go on then. Watch the ball, folks. We gotta figure out a way to kill this twisted fate. Fleet Feather Trap. Like, if they spend a lot of mana, we could play the Sacred Protector. It's unlikely. Challenges. The fate of mortals and spirits falls to me. So that's seven. Really hope they don't have another one of those. Yes, they do. Looks like I'm on a hot streak. It must be done. Sweep them away. First one's blue card, second one red card. I'm just gonna draw three. Blue as the serpentine. Okay, well, they have all the cards in the world over there. The dead 
don't need riches. There is no dispute. To eleven. Prepare yourself. We move soon. Hmm. Why don't you just walk there? Yeah, I was, I was definitely considering. Like, I was considering having one of these block the spirit leech and and then barrier. Or, you know, take more damage. Yeah, that's... The, I was kind of considering those things. to spend six mana to kill that river shaper at least they were going to try to a gift from the river folk. Ah! what form will the waters take all right four mana left don't have to worry about you know huge Removal spell with only four mana left. Like a vengeance or a, you know, something that we need to deny. Or, or not. So they killed the Shen even though I just got a new Shen. And they know that I just got a new Shen with the Shen boat. They still wanted to kill the Shen though. Space between worlds. Keep up, keep up. I find them unworthy. Protect the faithful. Forward. Something the matter. Wait a minute. Say your farewells. We live here. It's pretty unlikely that they can't stop. Let's see. Oh, wait, I guess I, I can't kill them, can I? Three, no. One man short from killing them. If I had a repost, we could kill them. Basically, how much damage should I do? My father's blade. I'll just do the extra three to get back to 19, and I'll save two mana to be able to protect Jarvan, I guess. I could do, you know, I could have done the plus three, plus zero, and done an extra six damage to them. Put them down to two. But to be honest, there's not that much difference between being at two and being at eight. It's not that much different. So that's the second go hard. They gotta have just a lot of go hards in their deck, right? Like these have to just continue to be more go hards. 
So I'm going to need to either deny pack your bags or if they have a second ruination. Next round. The thing is, they could have double pack your bags. No, now they don't have the mana. They can't have. They can't play a go hard and then two pack your bags anymore. You're still not leveled up. Two out of three. They keep using all all these glimpse beyonds. I was going to Cataclysm here, but now I need to Cataclysm the Twisted Fate. So, of course, I picked. Picked the wrong thing to barrier. Because you have to assume that they're going to want to. Like, they're going to let this happen. They're going to want to cast Packer Bags. And so we'll deny Packer Bags and then attack for the win. Okay, they're not even gonna, not even gonna try it. Raise our banners, Demacia prevails. All right, GGs. We're on the board. On the board with a win. Yeah, good win. As is real karma. Feel pretty good about this matchup. This is one where like a sharp side would would help. Well, I got I got Shen, so I can't complain too much. Um, but Ezreal can definitely be scary if they just have Ezreal that's creating a bunch of Mystic shots. That's why like one sharp sight is really nice to have. That's like the scariest thing. This is why I like playing Prismatic Barriers, why I only have one Repost and I'm playing three Prismatic Barriers instead. Because it's something like this, right? Like, we, you play your three drop on three, four drop on four, you have your three spell mana. And so, you know, you want that three spell mana to be able to protect, like, your Shen. But Repost does not. I don't think for four mana they're killing Shen. Could also simply tracker protege this round. Shen next round. Night falls. Strength in grace, beauty in the play. Glad no Hexite Crystal. Two worlds, one balance. I find them unworthy. I don't really care about the Fleet Feather Tracker dying. I know, obviously, we could barrier or protect it, but it's it dies so easily to everything, especially, like, Static Shock. And I am not going to want to spend resources trying to protect it whenever we have double Protégé anyway. Never ask. Uh, no. So, I mean, one Sharp Sight <clears throat> is usually very helpful. Alright, I'm going to take care of this thing while I have the opportunity. Got another Shen. That one's pretty damaged. The balance 
requires a watchful eye. Five, seven, thirteen. Alright, what's bad about that attack? I don't have any repost or deny available. They like Will of Ionia and stuff. Concussive Palm, probably. What if I just play River Shaper first? Palm's not that bad. I'm gonna play the River Shaper. I like drawing spells. Not too worried about Concussive Bomb when we have two four challengers. This is like the best card to deny because it's two targets for Ezreal and draws a card. It's one of the. Besides Will of Ionia, that's the, the best deny target. Like those are the those are the two targets, Will of Ionia and, and Static Shock. So I go. The waters take. Yeah, so they they wanted to palm after I declared attacker so that I didn't get the, the challenge. A little surprised they palmed. You know, kind of surprised they palmed the Shen instead of the River Shaper. They they could be at eight instead of nine, but then I wouldn't have the spell. I that's probably worth it on their part. A little surprised about that. My shield is yours. Honor dictates both our actions. Nine to eleven, twelve. It's forced equilibrium. Fair. No quarter. They are under my protection. We we'll probably have this from here. We got enough mana for both sharp side and repost. They have enough for like three hard removal spells. Three form you know, three Will of Ionia slash palm. Well, that's good. Good, no hexite crystal. Hexite crystal is a reason why I want to put the barrier on it on a two health thing. That's lethal right there. I can still save Repose, see what they do first. Remember, the Repose is plus six because because of the leveled up Shen. So whatever they answer to stay alive, Repose kills them, doesn't it? I think so, yeah. All right, we two and two. Raise our banners. Demacia prevails. The new, the brand new Suicide Squad is really good. Cool. Yeah, so Jack was just saying it was like one of the best DC movies, not like comparing it to Marvel.
All right, so this is what I'm worried about. This deck right here. Specifically the card Sejuani. Very worried about that. Okay, much better opening hand. So should this single combat be Concerted Strike? It did pretty good as... Um, it did pretty good as single combat the last game, helping us kill the Ezreal. That's it? Anything else? If I single combat right now, we keep them from enabling the plunder. I kind of much rather just go like you know play protege than play Shen. Who does not know the name Laurent? Oh, that's it. Looks like a harpoon. That they're thinking about using. No, Bobby, so Jack Jack was just saying, compared to the other DC movies, this one was really good for, for people that like DC movies. And when you just said Marvel's better, he, he wasn't talking about the Marvel movies. Like it wasn't he wasn't he wasn't saying it was like good compared to Marvel movies, he was saying it was good compared to the DC movies. He wasn't saying it was better than Marvel. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to do here. Let's do this. Because we do know that nature blesses her followers. Have something pretty good. We swim within the flows of magic. That's three out of five. Really, really hope they don't have Sejuani. I don't know what the chances are that they don't have Sejuani, but I really hope they don't have Sejuani. We know the value of coin. And it is not worth using. I want to single combat these. So they have the harpoon, like I've been pre predicting. If I block with Shen, then they kill Shen with harpoon. That's also not the worst thing. Immediately. It takes a harpoon out of their hand. We gotta get the harpoon out of their hand anyway. Sight. It's so hard to play around your own cards. 
Yeah, all right, well, that's not great. Kind of glad I didn't single combat, because then that would have been a 5-5, five five, and that would have kind of wrecked everything. So pretty glad we didn't single combat. That's true, I could just let Jarvan challenge the 3-2 and just challenge, have the protege challenge the 2-2. That was a really nice ice shard. Wow, that was a nice ice shard. Kind of good thing I didn't have the Jarvan challenge the 3-2, but man, that was a nice ice shard. And that gets towards the level up too. And then another black mark emergence. They still have two of my cards. Yeah, that's really nice. I'll shoot the wings off a of No quarter. Hmm. Please no set twenty. As long as I don't have said 20, you know, like, we'll be okay. Probably. That's, that's the card. Uh, we're in Diamond 3 somewhere. I don't know the exact... Oh, we yeah, have the one card. The one card. Okay, so we're going to... Plus three, plus zero, the Shen. Plus three, plus zero, the Shen. And single combat, and have Shen fight Sejuani. So otherwise, the Sejuani's leveling up, and we are dead. No, we need to... Let's see... Prepare yourself. We move soon. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, Shen, Shen transforms with the, with that, but. But, I mean, with the Sejuani leveling up, we're kind of dead. Hey, Scorpy. And the plus three plus zero isn't really necessary. That wasn't really necessary for me to play. It just gets three damage on the Sejuani. I don't know. That wasn't really necessary to play. Just 
Just gonna slowly kill this Edgewani. Come on. To the flag. I needed that to thing alive for sure. Good draw. Good draw. That'll do. I find them unworthy. Good job, Kordak. You're up to 165. Nice. Good job. What were you playing? Use a lot of cards to get rid of this one Sejuani. Really hope they don't have another. They have... But they still have two of my cards, don't they? I guess they still have... Don't, Let's get it, crew. don't they still have two of my cards? I don't know, I guess. Deny could be good. We never saw that monster harpoon I was predicting. Um. So this puts me down to four. Less than four. Man, that ice shard would have been completely devastating. That would have been game winning. Um, you've been playing Sejuani Heimer. Cool, cool. Is it worth trading Sacred Protectors? Probably not, no. No. Do, do they still have... I guess... I guess they have Sharp Sight or Twin Disciplines. Yeah, it's gotta be Sharp Sight or Twin Disciplines, right? Brayfin drawing Ice Shard is is really good. Oh, Spirit's Refuge? Okay. That Oh wait. I forgot that they got the double attack also. I was like that Oh, okay. Well then. 
defend their swords. All right, so that should be game. Let's see. No, we have to do. I have to do this so they have to block. Yeah. Because if I don't if I don't do this, then they don't have to block, so now they have to block. And then we switch it. I don't think they're staying alive from 14 double attack. Like it's basically do they do they have a spell that does two to my Nexus? Not. All right, good game. You fought with honor. Yeah, what what would they play for for a freeze card? Like three sisters, I guess. You know they would have like both their. You know they would have had a freeze. Both their things would be dead. So like it would have had all their cards dead. <clears throat> all right, I want to change the. So I'm at Diamond 340 LP. Yeah, the Deny top deck was perfect. Because, I mean, they had the Sprayfin top deck that got them the Ice Shard. Like, that Sprayfin Ice Shard combo was, was perfect. But then I had the Deny to, to counter it. Needed that, for sure. Okay, well, Streamlabs just isn't working. I want to update the record. I guess it won't let me. Viego Nasus. The upgraded Thresh Nasus. An upgraded champion. Let's find Chen. Chen? No. So if you missed it earlier, we, we're I'm playing seven games with each deck. These woods protect Today, doing three decks with seven games Try each. Uh, we are currently three and two, but I cannot change the record because the Streamlabs is lacking. It's not a bad start. Go better, bigger. Maybe they don't have Diego. That's a way for me to finally find a Shen. Ish. Mm. All right, there we go. Finally, okay. Three and two. Maybe do Nature blesses her followers. That. Gross. River shapes not a bad draw. Give it life. I wish I had one mana for one more yeah, one more mana for that. Kill the Reaper. I do this for her. For us. Man, I'm I'm one mana short also from plus three plus zero barrier combat. 
So, I mean, I can just play this, because I... I can only have five total mana. Gosh. It's nice having champions. These games that we lose are pretty ridiculous. Leeson Auction. Okay, Leeson Auction. I guess it's all going back. Shen! Yay! So second time in seven games that we've had a round four Shen. Only two out of seven games. Not very, not very many, or at least like in our hand. We maybe didn't even play it on round four before, and this could be the first time. I think I should actually. There's a good chance I should have just passed right there and then played the one Fleet Feather Tracker. Then it would kind of incentivize them to play like an action. And then I play the other. Because now they get to play action without. Okay, well, it does, doesn't matter. Without worry. Um, I... So obviously I could play Protege, but I go Protege, they go. Um. They go Merciless Hunter, get a free kill. Then, you know, I go Shen next round, but then I have no spell mana because I just used play the Protege. So by playing Shen now, okay, I was going to say that we have the spell mana. And I'm fine trading away one of these. What's up, Broccoli Sniper? I can endure the Dragon's Fury. Thank you so much for the sub. I appreciate that. These woods protect their own. Keeper, our lands need us. Gotta love Lucky Find with Lee Sin. My lands need. Prepare yourself. Your place is still in the mortal world. Strength and grace, beauty in the play. Heavy burdens. So the 
cannot get lifesteal. Sure. Yeah, so it's gonna be a lethal attack, and see, you know, we're gonna put the pressure on them to do something. You fought with honor. All right, GGs. All right, so we ended up four and three with our Jarvan Chen. We did fight through a Sejuani deck. So that was really good. I'm, I'm very uh, pleased by that result. They they did have a Sejuani also. Thankfully, they didn't have a second. A second would have been really difficult to, to fight through. Um, that was an, a good close game. All three of the losses, the hands the opponent had and just the cards they had were were pretty insane. They were all, you know, top 10% or better of, like, poss possible, like, you know, first five rounds, first six rounds of, like, what our opponents were doing. We uh, struggled a little bit against Viego. Right, like we we uh, struggled killing Viego, and Viego's really took over. Our opponents had like one one opponent had a, a round five Viego with multiple twin disciplines to protect it. Like that's just so hard to kill at that point, and just all you know other good interaction and you know glimpse beyonds and stuff like that. And then our other opponent with the with the Viego Nasus had really good aggressive start. Had Viego on six, I think, not not exactly on five, but on six. And you know was able to protect it, and um, and you know drew into atrocity. You know, like they they had a great hand too. So that that's what it seemed to take to defeat us. Were just some really really good hands. Um, so I liked I liked the power level of the deck, and I was happy how we got through Sejuani. Very happy with that. Single combat was okay. I'm not sure if I would want to turn it into Concerted Strike yet. Like one game Concerted Strike would have been better, but then another game Single Combat was better. So I don't I don't know. I haven't. I haven't really figured out whether or not I want single combat or concerted strike, but our deck's definitely the best when we have Shen, and Shen on four makes our deck the best. And but like as we talked about, I think I could be wrong, but I think we only had Shen on four in two out of the seven games, and that's a card that I'm heavily mulliganing for all the time. And so the the fact that we had a winning record and didn't really have Shen on four very often at all, and we ran into a a couple opponents that had pretty insane draws and insane hands. Um, I think that that's all a good sign. You know, the, the fact that all those things are true and yet we still had a four and three record. I think that's, that's a good sign. So there we go. That's Jarvan Shen. That's the first of our three decks today. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button and feel free to leave those comments and let me know what you think of this version of Jarvan Shen. Hopefully you've been playing it yourself and, and enjoying it. And if so, let me know over there in the comment section. But as always, Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.